Remember First Aid Kit. Who is Lisa Genova? She's a scientist, she's ever writer. The science of memory and the art of forgetting. Can you recognize which apple is the real logo among these nine? None. And correct answer. Like you see, repeated exposure alone simply isn't enough to guarantee that we will remember something. We need to add attention. And please, just pay attention to the video and enjoy. Three steps. How we remember, why we forget and first aid kit. Creating a memory takes place in four basic steps. Encoding, consolidation, storage and retrieval. You have to put the information into your brain. Encoding. Your brain captures the sights, sounds, information, emotions and meaning of what you perceived and paid attention to and translates all this into neurological language. Consolidation. Your brain links the previously unrelated collection of neural activity into a single pattern of associated connections. Storage. This pattern of activity is maintained over time through persistent structural and chemical changes in those neurons. Retrieval. You can now, through the activation of these associated connections, revisit, recall, know and recognize what you learned and experienced. All four steps have to work for you to create a long-term memory that can be consciously retrieved. Your memory isn't a video camera recording a constant stream of every sight and sound you are exposed to. You can only capture and retain what you pay attention to. And since you can pay attention to everything, you will be able to remember some aspects of what is happening before you, but not other people. Don't argue with people. Our daily experiences are essentially the same day to day. We don't pay attention to them. And because we don't pay attention to them, we don't remember them. We tend to pay attention to and therefore remember what we find interesting, meaningful, new, surprising, significant, emotional and consequential. Our brains capture those details. We ignore and therefore forget the rest. Your brain isn't interested in knowing what's boring or unimportant. We need to know. Optimists pay attention to positive experiences, and so these events are consolidated into memory. If you are depressed, you're less likely to consolidate happy events or pleasant experiences into memory, because happiness doesn't jibe with your mood. You don't even notice the sunny moments when you are only focusing on the dark clouds. Why we forget? Forgetting at an age is a normal part of human memory. We forget because we didn't pay attention, because we don't have the right cues or context, because what happened was routine or inconsequential, because we never practice, because we didn't get enough sleep, or are too stressed out, or because too much time has passed. For example, what do you know about your Prospective memory. Prospective memory is your memory for what you need to do later. This kind of memory is a bit like mental time travel. You are created at intention for your future you. This is your brain's to-do list, a memory to be recalled at a future time and place, and it's fraught with forgetting. Okay. We'll check it together our prospective memory. Rate your answers as 5 very often, 4 quite often, 3 sometimes, 2 rarely, or 1 never. Do you decide to do something in a few minutes time and then forget to do it? Do you fail to do something you were supposed to do a few minutes later? even though it's there in front of you, 
like take a pill or turn off the kettle? Do you forget appointments if you are not prompt by someone else or by a reminder such as a calendar or a diary? Do you forget to buy something you plan to buy, like a birthday card even when you see the shop? Do you intend to take something with you before leaving a room or going out, but minutes later leave it behind even though it's there in front of you? Do you fail to mention or give something to a visitor that you were asked to pass on? If you try to contact a friend or a relative who was out, would you forget to try again later? Do you forget to tell someone something you had meant to mention a few minutes ago? How did you do? My score was 21. Lisa Genova's score was 25. Lisa Genova didn't ask her one, never, or two, rarely, for any of the questions. Like you see, you are completely normal. And marketing companies take advantage of our prospective memory vulnerabilities all the time. Probably you join an online exercise program or download a meditation app. Maybe subscribe to a magazine for a free 30-day trial, fully planning to cancel or unsubscribe if you find that you don't use or like it. Yeah, I know that. Okay, and right now, first aid kit. And no magic. First of all, sleep. Getting enough sleep between 7-9 hours. Take a nap between 9 or 60 minutes. Avoid caffeine 12 hours before you go to sleep. Meditating. Sleep is critical for locking into long-term memory whatever you have learned and experienced. If you don't get enough sleep, you will go through the next day experiencing a form of amnesia. Some of your memories from yesterday might be fuzzy, inaccurate or even missing. Chill out. Through yoga, meditation, exercise and practices in mindfulness, gratitude and compassion, we can train our brains to become less reactive, to put the brakes on the runaway stress response and to stay healthy in the face of chronic toxic stress. Pay attention. You can remember a thing unless you first give the thing your attention. Decrease distractions. Put down your phone. Stop multitasking. Pay active attention to what you hope to remember. Be present to the sensory, emotional and factual information in front of you. Yoga and mindfulness meditation can help strengthen your ability to sustain attention in the present moment. When you maximize attention, you maximize your ability to remember. Surprise! 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 To help make a memory unforgettable, Use creative visual imagery, visualize, but go beyond the obvious, attach bizarre, surprising, disgusting, sexy, vivid, funny, physically impossible, interactive elements to what you are trying to remember and it will stick. Thank you so much, take care and I hope you will be remembered to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much, take care.